inspiration behind the hymn so my name is george wahin ajiman wete and i'm here as usual with elder kofi osu every year you would introduce our guest group na fe ye ze ejumedi no ahishe do in the year sh 532 532 day by day day by day and with each passing moment By day and in each passing moment, straight I find to meet my trials here, trusting in my Father's wise bestowment. Have no cause for worry or for fear. He was is kind beyond all measure, gives unto each day what he deems best. Love and love is part of pain and pleasure, mingling toward with peace and rest. Wonderful him. Let's pray. Strength we find in our Father's wise bestowment. We have no cause for worry or for fear. Our Father, we thank you so much. We are grateful once again for such an opportunity to worship. We commit our audience at home. We commit ourselves and our crew in your hands. Come and be with us in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Elder Yamin Shaw. We are delighted to have you with us today. Now, in the group, Yamia and Adum, Waba Bosfian, of our SDA Senior High School Choir. I will be a Sokori, a Okoforidia. In the um, SDFO, Yen Senior High School, our was a curriculum for the choir or honor one and the Waba Waba best Ryan now Eastern Region is Ghana yeah, Conference. Yeah, yeah, we have you know the advantage yeah. we have two main species in Ghana mm -hmm. either Bear Kwai or mm -hmm. Asakore. That's mm -hmm. all. Well, the group is social. I'm going to say, I'm talking about the very well renowned, renowned okay. one. Okay. You know. I don't go to Belkwai, I go to Asakori. Into one and the Yamia and Adum na Waba Bosia and Wufia. Na in Yuma Obezi can watu other men, a SDH six nine one. Lead me, Lord, and you mean Samuel Sebastian Wesley and Oye. Yeah. Elder, you know, it's, it's, lead it's, me. It's, it's a beautiful hymn, Jojo. Lead me. Lord, it's a, it's, it's a request, mm. a supplication that God himself should what? Lead, lead us. The way. It's a congregational hymn originated as a choral anthem. Originated as a choral anthem before it was converted into a hymn. Okay. Yeah. Sebastian's father, he was also called Samuel, was the youngest surviving son of Charles Wesley, making Sebastian the grandson of Charles Wesley. Okay. So it's a very wonderful hymn. Great, Sebastian was a great organist. Mm. He composed exclusively for the Church of England, received his bachelor's degree in music, and a doctor of music from Oxford 
in 1839. Wow. Yeah. Became professor of organ at Royal Academy of Music mm. in 1850. Mm. <laughs> you know, this hymn talks about leadership and the need for God to lead what? His children. Mm -hmm. it's, it's taken from Exodus chapter 33, verse 13 to 14. Let's read it. Book of Exodus chapter 13, chapter 33, mm -hmm. verses 13 to 14. Now therefore, mm -hmm. I pray, if I have found grace in your sight, show me your way. There's Moses speaking here. Mm -hmm. That I may know you and that I may find grace in your sight. Mm -hmm. And consider this, and consider that this nation is your people. 14. And he said, My presence will go with you, mm -hmm. and I will give you what? Rest. Let's add the 15. Mm -hmm. Then he said to him, that Moses is saying to God, If your presence does not go with us, do not bring up, do not bring us up from here. Amen. Amen. So Moses is pleading with God that before they leave this place, God's presence should, what? should lead them. If God's presence doesn't go with them, they will not go. Mm. <laughs> Moses himself, the one who parted the Red Sea, the one through whom God made manna to fall for, from, what? from heaven for his people, the one who fed, who, who gave water to the people from what from a rock mm -hmm. moses himself is saying that if god's presence god's leading doesn't go with them they will not what they would not go then i ask myself what about you what about me what do we know what level did have we reached in our spiritual life such that we think we don't need a leading of what of god if Moses, after all that God did with him, God appearing to him in such a theophonic manner, in a burning bush, God speaking to him, would still require the presence of God to lead them. Then what about you and I? That is the thought of this wonderful hymn. So it just have one stanza, yeah. eight to worship. Mm -hmm. Lead me, Lord. Lead me in thy righteousness. Make thy way plain before my before face. My Sometimes you don't see clearly. We don't see the way what? Clearly. Mm. The, Sebastian is saying that God should make the way what? Plain before him. For it is thou, Lord, thou, Lord, only that makest me dwell in safety. In safety. Amen. Amen. It's a wonderful hymn. Mm. Beautiful one. Mm. by this wonderful guy, the grandson of Charles Wesley, Samuel Sebastian Wesley. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Okoto <laughs> mwanu ma. Okoto wawo okoto. Ma okoto su wawo okoto. Nti, Charles Wesley, neba, neba, nti Charles Wesley, ni nana. Yeah. Samuel Sebastian Wesley, and I watch the me. Never seven day Adventist hymn now, no Or sentences and responses into your aid to worship, you know, a court as the age six nine one or just one stanza into your bosom. Yes, yeah, now, oh, yeah, yes, I can't. Yes, some no, um, and you might to at the boy or some no, yes, I can home. Lead me, Lord. Na Asokore SDA Senior High School Waboto no E flat major. Yanko de nko te nyumi ne yambra.
splendid ministration by SDA SHS Asokori. God bless you. Why is it? They are the very first we have on this program from mm -hmm. SHS. Mm -hmm. They are the very first. Mm -hmm. wow. And the open way. For, for, the rest, <laughs> for the rest to come. Yeah. <laughs> for the rest to come. Yeah. yeah. Beautiful. Yes, yes. Mm. Um, Yadamase, Yadamase, Yanshe N G sixteen. Oh, Munyami, Munyami, some as I be there, the bishop, uh, bishop, uh, <laughs> bishop Nankasaneza, on so much row, only other, you know, Munyami, that is the the tree, right? Mm -hmm. Translation says, Leave me and let me what? Praise. My God, Moon mm Yamina -hmm. Ming Tunya Copone, a whole ansem, a honum, a honum, a honum, may you meet you for ye, Moon Yamina. Yeah, the scriptural business is some hundred. Let's have some hundred, four and five. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful to him and bless his name, for the Lord is good. And his mercy endureth, endureth what? Forever. forever. Amen. So all of us have a desire mm. to praise God mm. for one thing or the other. Mm. But sometimes in this life, we are constrained. Mm. We go through certain experiences that seems to take away our desire for what? For praise. Certain very difficult things can happen to the Christian in our walk with God. And if you are not careful to open your mouth and to praise him becomes what? Difficult. Mm -hmm. It appears something is just holding you back. Look at the prophet Jeremiah, mm -hmm. that God called him to be a prophet to the nations. Mm -hmm. It got to a point, Jeremiah was so hurt that he said in Jeremiah chapter 20, verse 9. Let's look at what he said. Very interesting from Jeremiah 20 verse 9. Jeremiah is saying here, then I, then I said, mm -hmm. I will not make mention of him, that is God, I will not make mention of him, nor speak any more in his name. But his word was in my heart like a burning fire mm -hmm. shut up in my bones. I was weary of holding it back. Amen. Mm -hmm. Jeremiah was so troubled. He was persecuted, so troubled, so hurt that he made this confession that left him alone. He will not speak of the name of God was again mm -hmm. because of what he is going through. So Bishop is saying that sometimes we experience that as what? Well, as Christians. Something ties us down like fetters, mm -hmm. bringing us what? Down. We are not able to come forth and what? And praise him for who he is what he has done in our lives. The lesson for this hymn is that we should just be calm. God himself what, will take care of us. We must have an attitude of praise, no matter what. In all circumstances, what, give thanks to him, for he is what, good, and his mercy endureth forever. So it's not only us who go through that. Even Jeremiah the prophet says that. It's very, it's very serious. Though. Then he said, I will not make mention of him again. <laughs> you called me, but right now I'm tired. Oh. Take your Bible. I'm, I'm, going, I'm going away. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wonderful. Uh, yeah, yeah, wonderful yeah, name. Yamine yeah, Chizi, wonderful. Yes. Kukufi asi bebri wom. Nsofi bebri botum. And so, when I was one who to a razo dono. Adi nina. 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 Then you might watch Rosa Man Munyami MG sixteen. It was your phone over to no F major. You could say name, bra.
Excellent delivery. Hmm. Why are they? Well, that these young lads have opened the way for other second cycle institutions who may be interested in uh, ministering to the glory of God. Yeah. We are open. Just reach out to us and then we'll give you the opportunity to come and minister to the glory of God. Nyami Shramo. pa SDA SHS Asokore. Nyami Shramo. Uh, the young worship aids, no? Yeah. Uh, correct. Six, eight, four. Hear our prayer, O oh Lord. Is a petition. <laughs> Hear our prayer. Yeah. Hear our prayer, O oh Lord. Hear our prayer, O oh Lord. Please incline thy Thank ear to us, to us and grant us thy peace. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. It's, a, it's a beautiful prayer. It's, it's a petition. Mm -hmm. Six, eight, four. Mm -hmm. These words are a partial paraphrase of Psalm 116, verse 1 and 2. Psalm 116, 
verses 1 and 2. It says, I love the Lord because he had heard my voice and my supplications, because he has inclined his ear unto me. Amen. 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 So it's a paraphrase of Psalm 116, 1 and 2. The music is taken from a 1903 publication by a guy called George Hilton, who, which contained other responses and a hymn for dismissal. So he came up with a book of responses and a hymn for dismissal, like when you go for worship service. Mm -hmm. And then there's a service, there's a, there's a dismissal one. Him, a hymn that you sing mm -hmm. whilst you disperse yeah. from the worship grounds. Pilton was born in Herefordshire, England, on May 17, 1846. Emigrated to the United States at the age of four years with her parents. Studied music under Horishu Palmer, but earned his living as a trained pharmacist. Mm. So he was a pharmacist. But I don't really know what music. music, you know. Edited several music compilations and was a choir master in Buffalo, New York from 1903 to 1925. He passed on in the year 1930. Mm. So it's a very beautiful aid to what? To worship. worship. A paraphrase of Psalm 116, verse 1 and 2. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I'm emphasize a whole view. So, music no or your profession. But me, at I at profession. Yeah. But you can have other professions aside music. Into there are medical doctors who are musicians. Yeah. This why you want to say pharmacists. Your lawyers are where musicians. Your pharmacists are where musicians. Into maybe no. Don't limit yourself. Music no or yeah, they boy, you mean you may go to me that you you must have is busy, but any other profession so can one on say hey, you go to my baby before for so as I can elder elder a tax consultant that's why your music account. I'm a tax collector. Oh, your music account. Want to make it nice? Oh, that be a tax consultant. Oh, your music account. I'm assuming your insurance. I'm assuming your music account. Here our prayer, O Lord, George Welpton. 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 George Welpton. SDH six eight four. Young corner, young conco tables, your phone now, but no E flat major. Young corner, young bra. That was a solemn ministration by SDA SHS Asokori. Yadamase. Yadamase. Oh, the answer another powerful hymn. Now, Wayne Hooper. 
Anna Ochoi. He wrote this hymn in unison. SDH 214. <laughs> we have this, this hope. <laughs> Says uh, we have this hope. Tune is interesting. Yeah. <laughs> general conference. Tune <laughs> is <laughs> 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 a general conference. <laughs> The you second know, advent. The second mm -hmm. advent. You know, the, the reason why... Okay, let me start by saying that when Hooper is an incredible gift to the Adventist church. Uh, he he's, was one of the editors of the... Um, the one that we've been using for our research work. Yeah, the companion. Companion to what, the Adventist, Adventist hymns. Yeah. He was born in 1920. He's an author... He's a composer and a hymn writer. He was one time member of the Keynes Herald's Quartet of the Voice of Prophecy Radio Broadcast, Wayne Hooper. In 1962, he was invited by Charles Kamer. Mm. A committee was formed to have a theme song for the quadrennial session of the General Conference of the Adventist Church to be held in San Francisco in 1962. Mm. So the theme for that General Conference session was we have this hope. Okay. And when Hooper was commissioned to come up with a hymn that will fit the theme for the General Conference held in San Francisco in 1962. Mm. And that was his tax. He said he was driving to visit his son in school. And somehow, by inspiration, God gave him these words. We have this word, hope, that bends within our hearts. Hope in the coming of the Lord. Mm -hmm. We have this faith that Christ alone imparts. Faith in the promise of his word. Amen. Amen. So he came up with this wonderful theme song that was used at the general conference in 1962. Then in 1966, in Detroit, Michigan, they used the same theme. We have the word, this hope. The same song was used. Austria, 1975, the same hymn was what used. Mm. But then in 1995, at a general conference held in Netherlands, the theme was different. Mm. It was united in Christ. Mm. Therefore, when Hooper added the second stanza, and the second stanza, when you look at it, is what it talks about the unity, unity. of what of the church. We believe the time is here mm. when the nations far and near mm. shall awake and shout and sing, Hallelujah, Christ is king mm. we have this hope that bends within our hearts hope in the coming of the lord so that is the genesis of this incredible hymn 214 that we have that is why the tune is called general, general conference, conference. Mm. <laughs> wonderful <laughs> that, that's it. yeah <laughs> yeah now second stanza i've been to know yeah Oh, yeah, yeah, I need end of first stanza. First stanza, yeah, I don't know I, why. I think we should. We should, we should sing the second stanza mm. in addition. Oh, the, the second stanza was an addition. Yes. Because of the theme for that general conference. Yes. Yeah. No, but I tell you, we yeah. are united in Jesus Christ our Lord. Yeah. We are united in His love. We are united in His love. Yeah. Into today, they come. Yeah. Into we should have. We are better say. Yeah, two first stanza that we are. Yeah, first second stanza and and three ado. Na hum hum no on sor no on kosor pa. Inti SDH two one four na ya kama sa mi we have this hope when Hooper and a Ochro the minimum Ochro in unison. Ochro in unison, but on fa hum ye botum ya tu in parts. It can be sung in parts. Kwa afono wa ye guda they should be able to sing in parts. Na yama congregation no want to unison no. Na ye na yamfa yamfa yam osum no. Inti yabo kwa kote SDA Senior High 
high school a wo fi asokori ko for dia a ende enyi won resume na enyi me wo boto no a flat major yanko ne yanko ko te ne yemra Rendition by SDA SHS. Ah, the, the energy. Uh, oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. And I like the partner, um, Selassie, Kobe Babanao, or the Ashimu yeah. I Arrangements can create a And it's nice. Yeah. It's nice. God bless you. I as a Let's keep it up. You're uh, modifying your Yaman Kakrankakra. Uh, to suit our, 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 our circumstances in an area. No? I don't know where they are. You use that. You are fine. 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 next one. Um, SDH 5. 3-2. 3-2. Day by day. You are fine. You are fine. You are fine. Carolina Sandelberg. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Translator AL. Skog, yeah, mm -hmm. Oscar Anfield, oh, <laughs> mm -hmm. arrangement by Melvin West. Melvin so. West, ah. <laughs> uh, let's, let's just mm. see the two of them, okay. You know, Carolina Sandelberg is the text writer mm. for this wonderful hymn, and the arrangement that we have in the Adventist hymn now is by Melvin West, mm. yeah. This is one of 14 hymns that poured forth from the pen of Carolina, mm -hmm. right after witnessing the tragic passing 
of her father in a boat accident. Okay. She was 26 years old, mm -hmm. born in Sweden on the 3rd of October, 1832, mm. daughter of a minister of the gospel. She accompanied her father on a journey to Gothenburg, mm -hmm. but then there was tragedy that day. The father drowned right in front of them. Mm. And she lost her father when she was 26 years old in a very tragic manner, in a boat accident. But then she decided to, be, to, stay, to stay strong. And she found solace in writing a lot of poetry. And one of the poems that she wrote is 532, Day by Day. And it, it, is, it is referred to as a simple childlike trust in God and a deep sense of God's abiding presence in the life of Carolina after mm -hmm. she lost the father. So look at the stanzas. Day by day and with each passing moment, mm -hmm. strength I find to meet my trials here. Mm -hmm. Trusting in my father's wise bestowment, she, she reckons that ultimately our father is what? Is in heaven. Even though we have our early what? Fathers. Mm -hmm. But our real father is what? Is above who looks after us. I have no cause for worry or for fear. He whose heart is kind beyond all measure gives unto each day what he deems what best. best. Lovingly is part of pain and pleasure, yeah. mingling toil with peace and what rest. That is one a, a wonderful poem mm. that she wrote, turned into him, arranged by a wonderful musician called Melvin Hort West. So it, it was born out of tragedy, mm. but it has been a blessing to Christendom. Mm. And I love this hymn very much, day by day, and each, with each word, passing moment. Right there. Yeah. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right Onye Melvin West. One you ma Oye. Yanko na yanko kuti S D S H S Kia obo use no a E flat major. Yanko de Emra.
Beautiful ministration by SDA SHS. Arrangements and also lovely <laughs> arrangements. Wow. Now, arrangements, you know, I understand that Tom Feck, Tom Feck, a great musician. Yeah. On all them arrangements and what they can't know. Yeah, that, yeah, that one say, what one for fair, fair, so, what one for fair, fair. Nyami, in Shramo, Nyami, in Shramo, pa. Now, men san men kade, eyi, no, ye, ye him for the week. Yeah. Until Yaroto in the Sabbath, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, up to Friday, up to Friday, Yaba, yeah, you introduce another one, another one for the week. Until the end, and the end Friday to <laughs> Friday to Thursday, yeah, great. Until Friday to Friday, be yeah, no, you will introduce a new hima, yeah, the butch chai and hope for the week. Until this week, you know. My other call, I call it next week, you know, a day by day, SDH 535. See, oh yeah. Mobile home write ups in the be so. A bear, yeah, yeah, home, home, elder, but your true be. Um, uh, Uncle Richie. Uncle Richie in Katia, also what true be. Now, yeah, they are to talk to her. Now, marking can na when you inspiration, no, know, our walk them him, you know. Yeah, that when you know, Oh, the entry, the last yeah. for this episode. Yeah, last him like a benediction him. Yeah. <laughs> Almighty Father, Father, Almighty Father. Nah, you know me. The boy him now na. Oh, six nine three, six nine three. Arrangement, you know, here by Felix Mendelssohn. A great, a great Mendelssohn, eh? A great Mendelssohn. Felix Mendelssohn. Right? Yeah, you know, it's, it's, a, it's like a benediction hymn. Mm. Almighty Father, hear our prayer. prayer. And bless all souls that, that do what? Before that thee. wait before thee. You know, it's, it's, a, it's a two sentence prayer. And it, 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 it encompasses the latter part of Isaiah 30, verse 18. Mm -hmm. Blessed are all that wait for the Lord. Mm. One very popular scripture on waiting is found in Isaiah 40, verse 31. It says that, but they that wait upon the Lord shall what? Renew shall renew their, their strength. strength. So just like this hymn 693, that is employing us, that is seeking God to bless all souls that what? Wait upon thee. What are some of the blessings that we have when we wait upon the Lord? Waiting in itself is like, um, it's like having hope, mm -hmm. having an assurance in what? In the Heavenly Father. What are the blessings? We can still find that in Isaiah 40, verse 31. It says, they that wait upon the Lord, these are the blessings that they will mm -hmm. have. They shall renew their strength, mm. number one. They shall mount up with wings as eagles, number two. They shall run, they shall not be what? Weary, number three. They shall walk, they shall not what? Faint. So that weight over there is very, is so wonderful mm. that if we have the opportunity to wait, to hope, to anticipate in the, in in our Heavenly Father's coming mm. and His graciousness. These are the blessings that we will have. And Isaac captions it very well. Mm. They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their yes, what? strength. Yes. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run, they shall not be weary. They shall walk, and they shall not what? Faint. Yes. Amen. Amen. Wonderful hymn. Well, hold on. Let's admit that waiting wonderful move. Yes. <laughs> Waiting in the bubble. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's when you see waiting as just not doing anything. You know, but the, 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 the word from which we have the word wait mm -hmm. is not idleness. Okay. It's not just sitting down, not doing what anything. Mm -hmm. You go to a restaurant and we have waiters. Mm -hmm. They are what? They are waiting on us. Mm -hmm. They will bring you food. 
they will bring you water. Mm -hmm. They will bring you a drink. Mm -hmm. If you spill the drink, they will come and what? Mop it. They are what? Mm -hmm. Waiters. Mm -hmm. They are what? Waiting on you. So they that wait upon the Lord, it means that those who are what? In his service. Mm -hmm. Those who are just like they go mm -hmm. to a restaurant mm -hmm. and a mm -hmm. waiter will mm -hmm. come mm -hmm. and begin mm -hmm. to what? Mm -hmm. Wait on you. Mm -hmm. Provide a certain service mm -hmm. for you. This is, this, is, this is the meaning, the meaning of, of the, Isaiah uh, 40, 31. They that wait upon the Lord. Mm. They that what? Render service. Render service. Just Lord. like a waiter mm -hmm. in a restaurant mm -hmm. is waiting on you. Mm -hmm. Those who do that, their strength is what? Is renewed. renewed. They will mount up with wings like what? Eagles. Eagles. If they walk, they will not faint. Mm. If they run, they will not be what? Weary. Mm. So it doesn't necessarily connote just sitting down and, 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 and not doing what mm, it is in idle, mm, idling around, mm, no. Mm, mm, That's why it says that they that wait mm, upon the Lord. And that is, that is the essence. Very instructive. Yeah, that is the essence of this That's wonderful it. scripture. That's <laughs> it. It was here. It's the addition of no. It's the other thing. Bahade, Bahade that wait upon. That be waiting now. You're 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 waiting Waiting, no, yeah, providing specialized service For your to master. the Lord. Yeah. Eh? On a seven or a waiter, a waiter, and a jumo, yeah, a restaurant, I will be a or several. Oh, and portrait papers, eh? Memo, so I now, memo, you be good for my other paper, you be good table under our best. Them waiting, not some rendering a service unto the Lord. In turn, an elder. Watch it, Mono. The Yentasi, them. Other Yadasi, Yamias, SDH six nine three. Almighty Father. Arrangement, you know, you have from Felix Mendelssohn. Na SDSHS. Asokori, or what were you mean with key G major? Yanko, may I go to the name, right? Administration by SDA SHS. Wow. Yada Masi. Yada Masi pa nyami Ishrabu. Almighty Father and Watu. What am I hearing? Nebus Yafu, it has been a privilege hosting the Seventh day Adventist Senior High School at Wofi Asokori Kofuria. One year, you know, is it you may the seventh day Adventist senior high school? Our war as a Kori Koforidia one in the Wabe Wabesra Yeni na our East Ghana conference. Yeah, one head teacher, Nizende Madam Naomi Abna Yabua. Wow, Madam Naomi Abna Yabua. Hedi, yeah, that's it. I mean, sure, they're putting one more obey. School chaplain, your pastor Stephen Ampoma, on a year school chaplain. Director of the choir, no, a Mr. Emmanuel Osafo. Keyboardist, I want to say, instructor, a school hall. Selassie, 
baba nao ya da say oh, great guy yeah oh, great guy or oh, future pa music ne hunde he oh, loves oh, it oh he loves it he loves it na me me tell you our arrangements be wo wa why me tell ya hunde abrant no wo future ya da say nyame en shira o selasi and i say nya little keyboardist yeah ah uh, no so o be me me lovely girl e be do my in inti wo friend ama ama Chenewa Asari. Ama, a hey, Selasi new student. Okay. <laughs> Ama, a hey, Selasi new student. Now, Ama, ni parents, Oko Asor, Ewo Ligon is the church. My answer is for your own church. Yes, yes, yes. Ah. yes. She has Ama. a root in Ligon yes, yes, Adventist yes, yes, Church. Yes, yes. Mr. Kofi Asari. Uh, Neba, any Ama, Chenewa Asari. Yadam was say, it was your father, Mufi Koforia. Mobile, mobile sumian. I mean, it's ramo. I mean, I'm money, my me. So, what Charles was cool? Yeah, mm. yes. Uh -huh. So, also Charles was teacher. School. Yeah, uh, Florence. Florence. Asari. Asari. I mean, it's ramo. I mean, it's ramo. Pa. Chone se che abofra kwana onfado na uni na wenfiru hu ona na mugudwa muri. I mean, it's ramo. I mean, adum swa one anniversary we invite him. Yaboko ya kwako bwa one. Um, publicity so all day, Mamma, so the Yadbe Mamma, now be be a while can name him. Until you do her, may be a far home. Yamin Shram, Oda, what's in your me? In Shram, and that train as a pa, the be a train as a, and there's no strong hope. Yamin, it's all good. It was your first time, Mojaber, Moshe, inspiration behind the hymns, Yada Massa. They are brave, Yara, Munya time, Mother Mayana, Muni Emba, a babosum. Oh, closing remarks. Yeah, I think let's emphasize the the hymn for the week. Mm. SDH five three two day by day. Mm. It was written by Carolina Sandelbeck, arranged by Melvin West. It was out of her tragedy, losing a father, that she wrote this wonderful hymn for us. That she's taking what each day at a time. And the Heavenly Father's wise bestowment will guide her. So that is the song and the hymn for the week. Let's ponder over the words. By next week, at least we know one hymn. We know the author, we know the arranger. Wonderful hymn. Should we pray? Let us pray. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for this episode. We thank you for our children from Asokoriko for India. We thank you for granting them journey mercies here in Accra. We are grateful for what they have done for us, their administration. We pray for the entire school. We pray for these kids. May you bless them. Help them to know you more even as they grow up. Help their leaders in school, their headmistress, their music directors. Let this choir, in Jesus' name, move from strength to strength. We have prayed in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Five, three, two. It was your inspiration behind the hymns. Yami Aduma, next week, would come your way again with another exciting episode of Inspiration Behind the Hymns. It has been me, Jojo Ahin Ajman Wete, hosting you. God bless you.